Hi everyone, Dee's from Turtle Dove. Welcome to my channel. Hope everyone's doing great today. It is a, now what is it? It's a Wednesday evening and I've been going crazy recording ASMR videos but I thought I would record for my Turtle Dove channel. I had a Timu order come in, um, that's over on my ASMR channel, but I did buy some diamond painting earrings. Not a big set, I didn't buy, this is the only diamond painting product that I bought, because I've been wanting some earrings for a long time. Now, I can't remember how much these were. I think about $7. There's only two pairs in there. And they are double-sided. So I thought I would finish at least one side with you. We'll see how we go. I've got my timer on. So that's the first pair, pink and blue, and then pink and green, you know how I like green, so I'm going to start on this one. Let's just take the protective cover off. Sticky. One, two, three, four. I think there's only four different drills for that particular design. I have my Fruity Tooty diamond painting pen. I have a lot of um, diamond painting things from accessories to canvases all sorts of things um, and I'm pretty sure that most of the online diamond painting companies that you see uh, they sell through Timu as well my wax ready and let's get the drills I haven't had a, pop, a close look at these yet a lot of reflection going on there pink clear these are bigger blue ones hmm. I only need four of those for the other pair of earrings so you get plenty look at that green that's what I'll be using today I think another green Pink and clear. Let's just get them. I'm not going to kit up with these like I normally do because I'm only using what one, two, three, four, five, six, seven different drills or jemmies. Um, I normally just put them in a Ziploc bag when I've finished, put them in a bag. Store them. Okay, so what will I need and why? So I normally start with the biggest. That's an A, the Y, the U, A, Y, U, T, and W. That's T and W. So let's start off with the A. Oh, I should have cut that. 
flip them over. And you need one of those. And I'll just hope that they don't spill and I'll put them aside. Actually, I'll just lay them down here. And because I'm dealing with special gems, I might have to get my special gem pen. Where is it? That is the question. Just have a look in my box here. Um, hmm, I'm going to try this one. I don't know if I've used this one before. This one is good for picking up any type of gems and nail art. With this tip here, you can move the gems around where you want as well. And it's just got this piece of a wax cone it's just come off at the end, so hopefully it'll work. Yes. really pretty pink I don't know if the camera's gonna it's coming up a lot lighter than it actually is on camera do you like my placemat it's just like a plasticky placemat um, I've been using this white one for so long now and it's getting a little bit stained so I'll keep that underneath and then just yeah not many placemats to be bought around I think I got this from Kmart I looked in Spotlight and they didn't have any. Well, they had some, but they were so expensive just for what I want, so. Okay, why? I'll cut it the right side now, so. And that way, if you store them away and still write down what project they're from so if say I'm wearing the earrings and I lose a little gem I can come back and there's always spares so I haven't had to do that yet but now should I zoom in a little bit more this camera's terrible it wants to if I zoom in too much it just wants to go Blurry. I think that's enough. Not too much, but oops, wrong way. Oh, this pen seems to be working well. Look at all the nice little crystals in there. And these gems seem to be a little bit dusty, so I'll be wiping this with a lint-free cloth when I've finished, and of course I'll seal it. For these small projects where you only use six different drills or gems or whatever, it'd probably be good to get, um, I've seen them on the online stores, they get like little boats to put your drills in but there's I think a little one with about six or seven different sections so yeah I'll have to look into that that would be a good thing to get for real small projects like this you is another green Down there, drill. These ones look cleaner. My nails are so short. When I put 
put those the UV gel nails on a couple of times. They really ruined my nails underneath. So I'm not too keen to do it. I do have a few stick on nails, but they they can get ruined doing that as well. The glue just dries your nails out. But it is nice to have nice nails, fancy nails, especially over the Christmas period. Oh, that looks nice already. You can really tell the big green drills. They're not as shiny, they're dusty. But they can be fixed. Tea. It's pretty pink. in my finger. Maybe I can use this now here. This is such a fun pen. Look at all the bits of fruit in there. You just want to eat it. <laughs> So I started Tai Chi this week. I've been quite depressed the last, I don't know, few weeks and I think I've been uh, quite depressed. Really, it's just hiding and it's caught up with me for the last eight years or so. Um, so I thought it's time, time to look after myself and I thought it would be nice to meet some new people and I've always wanted to try Tai Chi. And just never did it, so I thought the community services have some things going, they have all sorts of things you can do. Um, so I thought I'll give it a go. And I was really nervous because I am not one, I'm not that social, I am and I'm not. <laughs> I just like my comfort zone and I find it hard walking into a room full of strangers and making small talk and such but I enjoyed myself it went for an hour and a half and yeah we'll see how it goes but I was so uncoordinated um, I mean, it wasn't, it is my first day, so I can't expect to. I think it's, there's some people there that have been going for years. They're quite advanced, so the teacher has to actually think of everybody, the new people and the the seasoned people there that have, know what they're doing. So, um, yeah, they have some easy moves they go through. They have a winding down little session and a warming up session and a few advanced moves that she does talk through so yeah it was just different so yeah next year's going to be all about me I think <laughs> I have to get out of my comfort zone big time
I'm one for talking myself out of things as well. So I just did it without thinking overthinking too much. But I did overthink the night before because I I am always clearing my throat. I don't know I have a cold couple of years back and I was coughing for six months and it's never really cleared up like it should. I've seen the doctor about it and everything but they don't really want to do anything. I did have a chest x-ray and everything was fine so that was a while ago, two or three years ago. But um, yeah I was worried about that and then I was worried about passing wind. <laughs> Because, you know, as you get older, you can't hold on to things as well as you used to. <laughs> uh, but, yeah, it was good. It was fine. I was worrying for nothing. But this is what I mean. I talk myself out of things so easily. I always look at the worst case scenario. But I'll continue it and give it a go, see how I like it. Only thing is, I'm the youngest one there. So I think most people are about a good eight years older than me. But that doesn't worry me, that age has never worried me. So yeah, that was my big highlight of the week, starting Tai Chi. I'm thinking of doing a course of some sort as well. And maybe trying to get a part-time job, but we'll see how that goes. Mm, this looks really nice. Oops. Oh, oh, see what happens sometimes. Thank goodness nothing fell on the sticky part. And it wasn't a whole tray. I remember doing a big painting. I think it was that Diamond Art Club. Oh, what's it called now? It was a huge diamond painting with the city scene along a river, five in Italy, that's what it's called, and um, yeah, I had about a quarter of a tray full of drills, and I knocked it over, all over the floor, it took me a while to clean up, and then of course you have to worry about all the dust and hairs and things, so yeah, be careful, don't drop your tray, <laughs> Mm, that looks nice and sparkly. I'm thinking of uh, perhaps starting to wrap some gifts up for Christmas for my granddaughters. As we adults don't buy each other anymore, we just concentrate on the granddaughters, so or nieces and nephews, whatever. And um, yeah, so I bought some a 20 metre roll of wrapping paper from Aldi today. I've still got some of the same in my cupboard but uh, it's always good to have another one for the following year so next year I probably won't have to buy any. But yeah I got for 4 dollars I've got 20 metres so that's really good and it's quite wide as well. Now how far we're in 20 minutes in so what I will do so I'll stop the camera and 
continue this. I'll probably do all of them actually. I'll do the other side. But that's it. It's got gold finishings, gold hardware on there. Um, and yeah, I'll be back soon and just show you the finished pair of earrings. I'm back 36 minutes and 5 seconds later. That's how long it took me to finish the two pairs of earrings. Now, as you can see, I have plenty of drills left. So I will be putting those in a snap lock tag with the code and storing that away. I just used three punch holes of the wax, so there's plenty of that left. I've got a separate bag just of all my waxes. Um, and I just went and grabbed my prescription glass cleaning cloth. And that's what I use, lint free, make sure that it's clean, lint free. Uh, there were quite a few drills here, these big green ones were very, very dusty or dirty looking so you could clean them separately before you even apply the drills but I think it's just as easy to wipe over now let's see one that I didn't do if you can tell the difference don't know if you'll be able to so just make sure I'm doing that on both sides I love the pink and green ones. The blue, oh, what's going on here? Oh, there's this bedroom over here. Oops, to put that back. Um, the blue and pink are pretty as well. That'd be fun to wear just around the house. Yeah, just make, yeah, there was actually, where is that? I shouldn't have moved it. You could see all the dirt that was coming off of it. find it now. Let's see if you'll be able to see once. A little bit. Yeah, some of them were quite dirty looking or dusty looking. And of course I'm going to seal these as well being earrings so you can see that section there it's all the dust that come off of it so they were dirty how pretty are they pink and blue on the other side and the green and pink Now, I might try them on. I look awful. It's, keep in mind, it's the evening, probably about 8 o'clock. And I did go shopping this morning. I did look good this morning, but I don't now. <laughs> so I'll just take my glasses off and I'm going to have to look through my viewfinder. And I'll show you what they look like on me. Okay, I look like death warmed up actually. <laughs> so, excuse me. My makeup looks awful. I'm tired. My eyes are watery and red. So let's put these pink and green earrings on and see what they look like. I'm wearing a lovely green top, so these will match. So. might end up editing this out yet, I don't know. I'll see what it looks like and don't mind the mess behind me. I've got lots of things going on. <laughs> oh, I like the big earrings. And they're so light, you don't even know you're wearing them. Very nice. Now let's put the other pair on. Let me know which one you like better, the pink or the green. 
pink and blue or the green and pink. These are nice too. I don't know, this side normally I have my hair down towards my face and this side I always pull back behind my ear. So yeah, what do you think? I'm happy with them. It was a nice, uh, I don't know, maybe hour project to do, a bit under. It took me 20 minutes to do the first one while I was talking to you. But if I was doing it on my own, it probably would have taken maybe five minutes <laughs> just to do one side. Ten minutes at the most. So, yeah. Nice, cute little set. I know you can get sets of maybe seven or eight earrings, six. Um, but definitely a nice little fun kit to do. So, anyway, thanks for watching, everyone. Look after yourselves, and we will see you in the next video. Bye for now.